This project is sponsored by PCBWay. They have all the services you need to create your project at the best price, whether it's a school project or complex professional project. On PCBWay you can share your experiences or get inspiration for your next project. They also provide completed surface mount SMT PCB assembly service at the best price and ISO 9001 quality control. Uh, visit www.pcbway.com for more services. Hello, in practice we very often need to measure low resistances. Measuring low value resistances, especially those less than 1 ohm, is nearly impossible with a standard multimeter. On the other hand, a commercial milliometer instrument is in the price range of several hundred dollars and is not cost effective for self builders. In one of my previous videos, I described such a device with a precision of 0.1 ohm, that is 100 milliohms. This time I will describe to you a simple and inexpensive way to make such an instrument, for the production of which we will not need more than a few dollars. With this instrument we can measure the resistances of 0.001 ohm or 1 milliohm. The result is displayed on a 4 digit 7 segment display that is easy to read even at wide angles. You can find the original project on the RCL radio page. Just to note that the code uses a, a STM32 library which has been modified by the author and is compatible with Arduino Nano. The heart of the device is ADS1110 integrated circuit, which is a precision differential input analog to digital converter with up to 16 bit resolution. The ADS1110 uses an I2C interface to communicate with the microcontroller and measure at 15, 30, 60, or 240 samples per second and has built in 1, 2, 4, and 8 voltage amplifier. The measuring range is from 0 ohms to 150 ohms. Auto is the device is very simple to build and consists of several components. Arduino Nano microcontroller. Next ADS1110 AD converter. TM1637 4 digit a 7 segment display and few resistors and capacitors. The measuring LEDs should be uh, as short as possible and they need to have the same length. To calibrate the to properly calibrate the milliometer you need to accurately measure the voltage of 3.3 volt supplied from the Arduino board and indicate it in the line of code define U33. Uh, the accuracy of the resistance measurement is directly depend on the accuracy of the 100 ohm reference resistance and the accuracy of the 3.3 volt voltage measurement. And now let's see how the instrument works in real conditions. This is 1 ohm resistor. Another one ohm resistor. This is 2.2 ohms resistor. Zero point forty three ohms. Zero point zero point one ohm. Two point two ohm resistor, two 
51 ohm Thirty nine ohm, and finally, a short conclusion this is an indispensable and very useful instrument for any laboratory, especially considering in the fact that it is very inexpensive and we can make it ourselves. The device is installed in a suitable box made of PVC board with a thickness of 3 and 5 mm and covered with celt adhesive colored wallpaper. I would like to emphasize that it is preferable to power the instrument from an external stable voltage source for greater accuracy.